think everybody around America wants to come to New York. There's so many different types of food and all these famous great restaurants. And you have Russ and Daughters, the Clinton Street Baking Company. People from all over the world come to eat there. What I like most about the Lower East Side, it feels like one of the last real neighborhoods in New York. The Lower East Side has been home to many different people. This particular area was a very Jewish area. You know, a pastrami sandwich, a knish, bagels and lox. Now if the Lower East Side's transforming, becoming sort of a destination spot for people to eat. Ivan Ramen is one of the premier restaurants in the Lower East Side, combining two ancient cultures, Jewish culture and Japanese culture, in a modern setting. With the food we serve at Ivan Ramen, I try to have some kind of connection to Japan, but as a chef, I have my own interpretation. I don't try to follow any guidelines. I follow my heart and my palate. I have your regular daikon, and that's pork ribs, braised, deep fried, and tossed in seasoning. These are really nice. You want a spritz of lemon. What is it on the outside? Uh, nori, sesame, garlic, sugar. Delicious. Ramen shops are somewhat similar to diners. Diners are my favorite places to eat. I like the idea of sitting at a counter and having a plate of food slid across the counter to you from the guy working the counter. What are we doing for noodles today? I'm a big Don Don noodle guy. In Tokyo right now, they call it Taiwanese ramen. This one's a real abadab. The spicy sesame oil, but no broth. I came into this game as a fine dining chef. I've worked in some very famous good restaurants, and some people are very disappointed. They say, well, you worked at all these famous great restaurants. Why would you do noodles? What's wrong? What happened in your life? Really killer, dude. The chef's job is to cook for themselves, and everything I cook is something I want to eat. Yeah. Here go. Yeah. What's up, buddy? How you doing today? I live on the Lower East Side. I live a block away. I'm usually here once a week. Nice to go to a place where you feel welcome, you're regular, they treat you well, and they have that here.